okay. You know, I was gonna do my top ten favorite TV shows, mainly fantasy. Stuff like The Witcher, Game of Thrones, Watchmen, Mandalorian. But now I can't. Because McFarlane decided to just go, Nope, this motherfucker ain't gonna do that. <laughs> so, yes, as we all know... <sighs> as we all know, McFarlane toys bought out DC. Mainly the DC Multiverse line. So they're gonna be making the US figures. So what does this mean for us collectors, especially me, because I do like DC Essentials, DC, um, and D Mayfax stuff. Well, it means we don't know what's going to be going on until these figures get released or we get official images. Because all we know right now is the characters that we're getting. We're getting three versions of Superman and Batman, uh, comic books, basically, um, which I'm excited for that Superman and Batman. I'm going to get the comic ones. And then we're getting animated ones. Might get those. And then we're getting armored ones. I'm not going to get those. We're also getting Batwing, uh, Nightwing, Batgirl, sort of Bat Family. Um, John Stewart, Green Lantern, Harley Quinn. I, I was really surprised that there was no Joker in that. I, I was surprised by that. But who knows, maybe they're going to wow us with a Joker action figure from the Walking Phoenix movie. I I'd admittedly not be surprised by that. I'd be ecstatic, though. Um, and then we got the big one, the one that everyone cares about, the Batmobile. I mean, the Bat Cycle. Yeah, everyone's super excited for that. No, no, no. We all know who it is, the Batman Who Laughs. That's the figure that I've wanted for a long, long time and thought about just making my own. <laughs> but, um, I was really, I was worried because I do like McFarlane. I love Shigaraki and I love, uh, Scorpion. I know a lot of people don't, but I do love them. Um, and I was worried. I was like, they're sticking really good with game figures. But, you know, they aren't giving enough accessories to some of them. I mean, I love the new look for the Cyberpunk 2099, uh, Johnny Silverhand. But he doesn't come with another hand. He only comes with the hands that he's given. And that's really annoying. I don't like that. Unless they are gripping hands, which he has a rock on hand. And I hate that with Dr. Manhattan. I feel like I have to constantly have him pointing or doing the head thing. So yeah, that's kind of my main gripe with it. Now, there is good news and bad news if they decide to go a 6 inch or 7 inch. I'm assuming that they're probably going to go 7 inch. That's what they are good at. That's what they've done for a while with Peely and all their figures. So I honestly wouldn't be surprised if they said, hey, we're doing this whole 7 inch. But on the other hand, we are seeing if they are 6 inch... That'll fit in easier with Multiverse. Um, which could be good. We could get all the guys that we haven't gotten in Multiverse. And we could get the figures that we've needed for Multiverse displays. So yeah, that would be kind of the best part. But obviously we're not going to get what we want. You know, that's how it is. <laughs> I am really excited though. It is very, very exciting. Um, to see oh, what's going to go on. I am sort of excited. I do like McFarlane. They have been doing some good figures. Um, they're doing really good with My Hero Academia. And then some game figures. If they don't make the Witcher series, I'm going to be pissed. <laughs> Alright, that's my favorite video game. And uh, maybe it's going to be one of my favorite TV shows. I don't know. I've only saw two episodes so far. Plan on watching the third one tonight. Um, but yeah. <laughs> it is exciting. Um, we are getting a Build-A-Figure. It's gonna be the Batmobile. <laughs> I thought that was, a uh, really weird. Um, it is weird. I'll admit that. Um, but what is gonna be interesting is are they gonna use every DC line? And are they gonna use DC TV shows? We do know that they're making an Arrow figure, so I can assume that they're gonna make The Flash and maybe a whole Crisis on Infinite Earth series. But are they going to do other shows? Are they going to do stuff like Joker? I mean, that'd be pretty cool. I don't know if they have the rights to it. And do they have the rights to the movies? I mean, they probably do. Because I think they bought out all of DC Multiverse. But who knows. I would want to see one bunch of figures. The Watchmen TV show. I'd love that. But, you know. Anyway, I've been Rodimus2099. I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.